Hey there, story lovers. Welcome to chapter three of our thrilling tale. Tonight, we're diving into the heart of Hollyville, where the festival of redemption is in full swing. Picture this, a starry night sky, each twinkle a nod to the spirits watching over us. The town square is alive with laughter and music, lanterns swaying gently, casting shadows that dance across the cobblestones. But beneath this lively scene, there's a tension you can almost taste. The townsfolk are gathered around an ancient lantern, its glow hinting at the power it holds. So, buckle up, because this chapter is about to take us on a journey of emotions, revelations, and maybe even a little redemption. Now, this reminds me of those moments in anime where the protagonist stands at the crossroads of destiny. Elena, wrapped in her father's old jacket, feels the warmth and weight of his legacy. The lantern's light pulses in sync with her heartbeat, calling her closer. The whispers of spirits, once distant, now surround her, urging her to face her past. Beside her, Lucas, usually the Joker, feels a shift within. He reaches for Elena's hand, a silent promise of support. Together, they stand ready to confront whatever the night holds. The festival's energy is electric, a mix of celebration and anticipation. Oh, but here's where it gets really juicy. But what if I told you that the festival's joy is about to be challenged? Enter Mr. Hargrove, his tall figure casting a shadow over the festivities. His voice booms, warning of the lantern's misfortune. Fear ripples through the crowd, but Elena steps forward, her voice cutting through the tension. She speaks of embracing the spirits, understanding their stories for redemption. The crowd wavers, uncertainty flickering in their eyes. Lucas, feeling a newfound courage, echoes her words. The lantern's glow intensifies, revealing shimmering spirit forms. The air is charged with energy, a confrontation brewing. Yeah, you thought it was over, think again. As the festival reaches its climax, Elena stands firm, her gaze fixed on the lantern. She feels her father's spirit close, a comforting presence urging her forward. This isn't just a festival. It's a chance to heal, to unite the community, and to face their fears. The lantern shines brighter, a beacon of hope amidst the darkness. The night is alive with possibility, and Elena knows this is just the beginning of their journey toward redemption. All right, fight me on this one. I dare you. This chapter has set the stage for an epic confrontation between past and present, and I can't wait to see where it leads.